Good morning. You are listening to Upreach, a morning devotional presented by the Church Street Church of Christ in Lewisburg, Tennessee, to encourage you as you face the opportunities and challenges of today. Let's begin this day together with some inspiring thoughts from God's Holy Word. In Matthew chapter 7, verses 24 through 27, as Jesus is closing that part of Scripture we commonly call the Sermon on the Mount, Jesus utters these immortal words. Therefore, whoever hears these sayings of mine and does them, I will liken him to a wise man who built his house on the rock. And the rain descended, the floods came, and the winds blew and beat on that house, and it did not fall, for it was founded on the rock. But everyone who hears these sayings of mine and does not do them will be like a foolish man who built his house on the sand. And the rain descended, the floods came, and the winds blew and beat on that house, and it fell, and great was its fall. There are two kinds of people in the days of Jesus. Some hear the words that Jesus speaks and are awed by his wisdom and understanding, yet they do nothing about what they hear. Others hear these words and act on them. Jesus says that those who hear the words but fail to put them into practice are foolish, and he likens them to building a house on sand. How foolish indeed it is to build a house on sand. On the other hand, the person who follows what Jesus teaches is a person who is sure to weather life's storms. Listen to the words of Jesus again. Therefore, whoever hears these sayings of mine and does them, I will liken him to a wise man who built his house on the rock. And the rain descended, the floods came, and the winds blew and beat on that house, and it did not fall, for it was founded on the rock. Matthew chapter 7, verses 24 and 25. You know, it is a curious thing, but you never know how well your house is built until it is tested by the elements. Torrential rains reveal the quality of your roof. Wind and cold reveal how well your home is insulated. Heat and sun reveal the quality of your paint and siding. All these elements reveal whether a solid foundation is laid to make your home a secure and lasting place to live. When we are truly honest with ourselves, many of us find that we are only giving lip service to God's commands. We are faced with the reality that our foundations are not strong enough to weather life's storms. What about you today? How do you react when trials come? Do you tend to fret and worry? Do you attempt to take life into your own hands? Do you respond inappropriately when you fail to get what you want? The Lord uses these times to help each of us recognize whether our foundations are made of sand or rock. So why not ask the Lord today if you have built on His rock? If so, you can be comforted to know that you can weather any storm that may come your way. This has been Upreach, a presentation of the Church Street Church of Christ in Lewisburg, Tennessee. I am Kyle Bolton, the pulpit minister at Church Street, and I would like to personally invite you to come and share times of Bible study and worship with us each week. We meet every Sunday at 9 o'clock a.m. for our morning worship, followed by our Sunday school for all ages at 10.15 a.m. Then we meet again at 6 o'clock p.m. for our evening worship. We also have a midweek meeting for devotion and Bible study on Wednesdays at 6.30 p.m. I hope to see you there. Have a blessed day. To the King who gave everything for me, whose body crucified high on Calvary's tree, whose redemptive blood makes way for me, I now give everything. To the King who came in the form of a child, all-powerful God, and yet so mild, Whose obedience shows the way for me, I hope.